Hi everyone, it's me, Spring, the Fiber Enthusiast, and a welcome to the channel. I want to welcome each and every one of you, whether you have been here from the beginning or you are just now starting to watch. Thank you for joining in, and I want to also give a big shout out and thank you to all of the channel members. Whether you have been gifted a membership or you have purchased a membership. Thank you very much. I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, so Sunday, Sunday is our recap of what I've been up to over the past week and maybe what's to come on the following week or in the near future. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday is tutorial base, whether it's one of my own patterns or it's stitch tutorials or um, maybe even like the spinning demonstration that I did, a uh, tutorial on how to reconnect your roving if you lose um, your roving. So that was kind of for beginner spinners. And I believe that I will be doing a few more um, of those occasionally as we go. I did a couple hats last week as well. There was a crocheted hat and a knitted hat. The hats that I'm making go to K and K Crochet for Bumblebee Mountain Outreach. So if you would like to know more about that, you can pop down to the description box and click on it says other channels that are mentioned. It'll be K and K Crochet, and you just pop over to their channel, and there you have videos on it. Just kind of look at it, and you'll be able to see uh, Bumblebee Mountain Outreach uh, videos. So that's where my hats go, and when I'm creating tutorials for hats, that's where they're going. Upcoming tutorials, I am working on some mitered squares. We were asked during the members only live, I was asked if I would do knitted and crocheted mitered square as well as the Solomon's knot. And I'm not talking in crochet. Um, the Solomon's knot, I will be using paracord, which I have set up back here to record. And the reason that came about is because I have some hemp jewelry that I made using the Solomon's knot for the choker part and some of the earring. So that is coming. This is the um, mitered square for this first video, and it's just a basic mitered square. I do have a mitered square of my own that will, I will be adding to that playlist. This past week has mainly been, for me, a lot of spinning. I'm trying to get caught up after uh, the big shawl and all of that. I'm trying to get caught back up. I had some commission yarn I needed to get spun. Uh, this is two of the Hanks Complete, which you can see they're huge. Um, there's probably 900 yards here. They need to go in to soak to allow the fiber to bloom. And once they are dry, then I will run them back through and check to see how many yards they are and rehank them at that point. So that's, those two are almost done. Another, the same person commissioned more of the same that I had already made for her in the past. So I have started it on my electric spinning wheel, the Ashford, as well as Blue Bonnet Bumblebee four ounce bobbin manual spinning wheel. So I did a lot of spinning as well as the hats for last week are completed and available, of course. This was Drumline and, uh, forget the other one. <laughs> My brain is, is shutting down for the day. Um, but anyway, uh, so these are on the road again. That's this one. On the road again. And this is Drumline. So uh, those two hats are available from last week's tutorials. Now they can go with the rest. Now, 
If you've been around for a while, you know that I don't get a chance very often to work on um, something someone else has going on. And it's hard because there's a lot of projects that I really want to do. Um, I did manage to get a sun bunny made and occasionally I can get in a, a few minutes here or there to work on something somebody else has. Um, that's always nice. And with that being said, I, Sunita, her link will also be down in the description box. She has a little, little thing going on and they're making, um, different patterns and everybody's entering their, you know, their pattern, not their pattern, but their make from a pattern. And it's all, you know, everybody has like five different types of patterns that they can make and enter to win. This is the beret. Now, this is hand spun yarn. This is some of my hand spun yarn from quite some time ago. But this is a beret. And I will insert a couple of pictures. Okay, so I will put the information down in the description box about whose pattern this is. And the only reason why I'm not saying it is because I'm ill prepared and I don't know it. <laughs> I don't remember the name, but I will most definitely have it down in the description box. And that's just poor planning on my part. I'm trying to get my video done. Um, we have had really horrible, horrible internet service uh, since yesterday's storms. I'm not sure if this video is even going to make it in time for Sunday morning at 6 a.m. We shall see. But that is it for me today. Um, look forward to the tutorials on the Solomon's Knot with the Paracord, as well as the crocheted basic mitered square and a knitted basic mitered square. We will increase from there every so often adding a new mitered square, including one of my own. So that will be it. I hope that you all have a wonderful week. Thank you for watching. We have a nice slideshow of everyone's pictures that uh, was shared in the Facebook group or private email to me. Thank you for sharing your work with the rest of us and also at the very end, our membership credits. So everybody that is a member is at the end of the video and it's all screenshots from the lists. So if your name was accidentally missed, I am terribly sorry. It's just when I scrolled up, I may have accidentally missed your name and I don't do that intentionally. It's just just a slip of the finger when I'm sliding that up to take the next screenshot. But thank you all for coming and hanging out with me on Thursday nights for our live spin and chat. Real quick, if you haven't done the Red Rover Reverse and you've seen those videos around, I encourage you to do your own Red Rover Reverse. If you are a content creator, whether it be just a community tab or a shout out in Facebook, or if you make actual video footage content, um, just hashtag Red Rover Reverse and shout somebody out sending your group of friends over to that person's channel. So thank you. Be blessed. Be a blessing. And until next time, bye for now, everyone.